Hi everyone, good morning. Uh, welcome back to our vlog. Um, we're just going for our weekly long walk on a Saturday. Where's Tiff gone? Where are yeah. you? There you are. Yeah, we're gonna um, try and do a 10K again, like yeah, last a, weekend. It was a big walk last weekend, wasn't it? It was a long walk. So yeah, we're gonna see how that goes. See you later. Just down by the river having a walk. Uh, it's not that warm today, actually. <clears throat> It's, uh, it's a nice day, but it's, it's a bit of a breeze. So yeah, glad we put a jumper on. Um, just enjoying our walk, to be honest. It's, it's nice to get out the house. We're just in Fulham by the river. It's a little bit colder than last week's walk. Yeah, um, just having to sit down on a bench actually for a bit. It's nice and quiet here. There's not many people around today. We haven't seen that many people actually. There's a lot yeah. of cars on the road, but not too many people. Yeah. Uh, just flip around so you can see the view in a second. But yeah, we're just having a nice sit down. But it's actually kind of cold. We want to make our way home soon. It's not cold. It is cold. What are you saying? It's windy. it's windy, but it's not cold. It is jumper weather though. Mm. It's cold. But it's nice to be outside. You want to go back already? Yeah. Give it five more minutes. No, we have to. It's an hour walk we'll home. Is it an hour from here? Yeah, it's an hour. It's just told everyone where we live now. An hour from Fulham. <laughs> <laughs> it's not an hour from here. That's about 20 minutes. Because it's like a big loop, isn't it? Anyway. Hi, guys. So, uh, this evening, something's about to happen that hasn't happened before. That is, Tiff is going to cut my hair. Now, I'm a little bit nervous about this. Um, it hasn't happened before, but my hair also has never been this long. So it's in a bit of a mess at the moment, as you can see. And it's even my glasses are falling off because like there's no grip on the side of my head. So anyway, um, yeah, so <laughs> Tiff's going to give it a go. Uh, she's going to try and cut my hair. We'll do a little 360 in a second to show you how bad it actually is. So there it is, the barber's chair, ready to go. So we've definitely got the right tools for the job. Um, Tiff did a little shopping on Amazon. So I'm sure there's at least one comb in here that will be fit for my um, monstrosity of a hair right now. But I don't even know what some of these combs do. Like, I've never, ever, I've never seen a comb like this before. So I have no idea what that does. Um, or this one for that matter. I've never come across a comb like this before. So anyway, we'll um, yeah we'll link this comb set below. It's a very simple comb set from Amazon, but we'll just link it below anyway. Uh, and also we have these scissors that arrived. They look a bit fancy, a bit professional. Um, so hopefully they'll do a good job. Didn't really want Tiff tripping my hair with the uh, with the kitchen scissors. So yeah, we'll see how this goes. But yeah, they look the part. Okay, Steph, so we're gonna cut your hair. Let's quickly do a 360 before we say goodbye to it all. Not all, some of it. It's looking quite flicky at the back. And show your fringe. My fringe, what fringe? Oh. So I'm not sure yeah. how much of this we're gonna cut off. You Gosh. wanna keep a bit of it, right? Well, you're not gonna give me a fringe because I, I do this. Not if, yeah, that's what I mean. <laughs> okay, so. Let's um let's get going. So we're all prepped. Uh I've washed my hair for tip to get started. Uh and we have our makeshift uh what is it? A recycling bag to minimize the, the, the mess. <laughs> so <laughs> let's see how this goes. Okay, are you ready? Ready as I let you ever trust be? me? Yes. Okay, <laughs> good. <laughs> That was very, very stressful. May I add? I actually um, think it is the best haircut you've ever had. No offense to your barber, but he usually cuts it really short. Okay, I need to tidy up the back, but I think. What's wrong with the back? The, your neck bit, oh like my. with a shaver. Oh, right, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think that would look good. Um, but generally, I think I've done a good job. Um, sort your fringe out. 
But it's so Is that how you do it? Yeah. Oh, I thought you brought it forward. Anyway, it looks good. So, uh, yeah, I think that was very, very stressful. Um, more so than it probably should have been. But yeah, I think it'll it'll keep me going for the next few weeks. And I really need to get out of this bag because it's, I'm not breathing in here at all. <laughs> So now that that's done, uh, I'm actually really relieved. I don't think it looks too bad, actually. Um, you know, it's better to keep it a bit longer than shorter. But um, no, I think Tiff's done a good job. Now, uh, what mm -hmm. are you doing now, Tiff? I'm gonna hoover up. Tiff's gonna hoover up. So I'm gonna take a quick shower, um, just to get some of this hair off, and Tiff's gonna hoover, and then we're gonna cook some dinner. Now we're all done and the haircut's looking great. Uh, we're just gonna have some dinner. I think stuffed peppers tonight, Tiff? Yeah, stuffed peppers. Stuffed peppers with some meat. Um, and then we're gonna settle down, watch some TV. We've got a bit of white lines left to watch, but we also need to watch Killing Eve. So don't know, we need to decide um, which one to do. To be honest, I've been stressed all day about that haircut. Uh, so I'm kind of glad it's over. So tonight we've just got some uh, minced beef, some passata. I've uh, just thrown some um, green pepper in there as well and some onion, sorry. So we're going to mix that all together and then serve it in a red and a yellow pepper and have a sprinkle of feta on top. So yeah, it should look good. Otto just overseeing dinner preparations. Is that right, Otto? Otto! <clears throat> so tonight, we've got some stuffed peppers with a beef and tomato uh, center, uh, topped with a little bit of feta. Uh, so we're gonna enjoy these now, a little San Pellegrino, and enjoy our evening. So, a busy day done. Mm -hmm. Oh, such a busy day today. Um, it's been a really warm day today. Maybe that's the what it is. The fans have been on a lot. Yeah, maybe that's what it is. Mm. I feel a bit um, warm. Yeah. I'm just tired. Um, and I think I was nervous for my haircut. Which has turned out really well. I think it could have even been shorter. I did say shorter there. at the time, but I think keeping it a bit longer wasn't yeah. a bad idea. Right? Yeah. Um, so yeah, we've had dinner. Now we're just going to... What are we doing to White Lies at the moment? No, White Lines. White Lines. Set in Ibiza. Would you say it's like a murder mystery? Um, yeah, it's like this woman goes back to Ibiza to investigate her brother's murder. Um, and but saying that, we find it a little bit funny. Like some parts you can laugh at, funny, although actually. I'm not sure if it's meant to be funny. No, it is funny. It's good. Um, yeah, it's the best thing. It's on Netflix at the moment. So we're here on our daily walk. At the, uh, we just come up to the Duke of, Duke of York Square, which is usually heaving on a Saturday morning because they have a food market here. Uh, but right now it is absolutely dead. There's a lot more, a lot more traffic on the roads, um, but definitely, yeah, not many people around. We nearly got caught in a shower earlier, but look at it now; it's beautiful. So yeah, we got the umbrella ready. But so uh, Tiff's been craving a Starbucks for a while. <laughs> We managed to get one on the app, mm -hmm. wasn't it? We couldn't go into the shop, so we had to just get it on the app. Um, took didn't take long; it took about a couple of minutes for them to make it. Yeah, we were like the only ones. In the we were like the only ones in the queue. Yeah, Tiff uh, put it in. Two. What have we got? Two frappuccinos. Two it's not that warm, and, and we got stuck in a shower. Um, but we're both here drinking iced coffee. <laughs> it was so, so cold. Drinking iced coffee too. So I don't know about you, but every time I get given a, pla a paper straw, it's like the worst thing in the world. There's nothing worse than a paper straw. I know they're better for the environment, but to get halfway through a drink and then it just starts to like disintegrate. Do you know what I mean, Tim? Yes. We need to carry our metal straws with us. Ah, oh, but I don't. Yeah, metal, yeah, but then you've got to carry you carry a straw around with you and then you've got to take it home and clean it. Mm. So, whenever you get given a paper straw, you should always ask for two because one is never enough. Just proving a point on the plastic straw front. No plastic straw paper straw front there's tiff and there's a drink with a <laughs> straw mine's not a lot better but there's a big hole in it uh yeah really don't like paper straws rant over so tonight tonight we're having our first tennis uh game in a while tiff's a little bit rusty but uh but we're getting back into it 
Um, yeah, it's good exercise for us, but yeah, Tiff's a little bit rusty. It's nice now they've opened up the tennis courts again. Um, Tiff, did you enjoy that? Yeah, it was very good. Oh, I'm much better than I thought I was. Much better than you thought you were. Yeah, I thought I was going to be really rusty, but actually I am really rusty. Yeah, rusted. you're okay. We need to, um, yeah, we need to practice a bit more, and then I'll start serving at you. You'll never hit them back. Head, should we head yeah. home? Should yeah. we head home for some dinner? I'm gonna head back for some dinner now. See you later, guys. Bye.